and everything that's sitting on top of it. Karma for being a motherfucking player. I can't make this shit up. Ooh. And they being divinely guided to heal. Mm. Yes. There could be an Aquarius that could be holding back. This person, they could, there could be, I also heard, <clears throat> this is not going to resonate for all y'all. Some of them, there is an uh, a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, somebody that has fire. This person is their karma. And they could have Aquarius in their chart. This person is holding on to this person and this is their damn karma. They're holding back from taking any type of action to communicate with you, family. And they are ashamed and humiliated for how they behaved with you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And this person is scared to come forward because they know that they have been stubborn and selfish, overindulgent, partying, drinking, smoking. And this is what brought in the tower because God gave them enough time to do the work to fix things, to heal themselves and to move forward. So your person, oof. Look at this shit. Do I need to explain this? Look at this. I got three majors right here. Tower. Devil. Karma. For what? Juggling. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that, that speaks within itself. Give me some messages of love. Divine timing is at work in your love life, family. Wow. Wow. Your person is really going through it. But you cannot come in and hurt my collective. I'll be damned. I make sure that my collective knows everything that they need to know. Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. Finances and career are an obstacle in some of y'all love life. If this isn't you, then this is your person. This person is with a karmic soulmate. It's in the reverse. For some of you, this is a karmic to you as well. And this person is not trying to get to know you. They only want to come in and fuck you. Or come and fuck you for your finances. A lot of them, they don't feel like it's safe to love. Some of y'all feel the same way. That's the mirroring effect. See where the cards are falling? This person doesn't think they're worthy of love. And they are lovable. But they just have to do the healing work. <sighs> Give the relationship a chance. Work on the partnership. And keep an open mind. Your soulmate may you, uh, differ from your usual type and expectation. This has been your reading family. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your family, friends, and coworkers. You can find me here on YouTube as Ascended Twin, 144K. Here's where I do all different types of readings, family. Also, um, make sure that you hit the like, comment, and subscribe button if something here resonates for you. If you go to my About section, you will see the other channels that I own and operate as well. It's two channels that are currently under construction, but I think they're going to get some attention today. Um, <laughs> family, if you would like to donate to the channel, um, there are a couple of items that will show up if you do decide to go to my Amazon wish list. But those are not for you guys. Um, I have to figure out how to separate that off again. Um... Those are my own personal orders and items for a wish list of my own. Um, those are not for you guys to do. The only thing that you're responsible or obligated to uh, gift me off of my wish list in my mind would be any um, items that would be used for healing and divination <clears throat> and teaching. Also, family, if you would like to book a reading with me, do so at Twin Flames with a Z, 144 at gmail.com. I love you, Soul Tribe. Y'all take care of yourself and stay on the ready because your person, they have not done the work yet. And a lot of them are jealous of you because you have done the work, okay? Until the next time, family, peace.